did you ever hear from uh, Candace? Bur- uh, uh, <laughs> CCV? Yeah. Um, yeah, after our... Uh, so... It's, it's, it's tough. It's tough. So Candace and I... I've had to accept that we're never... I'm never going to change her mind. About what? About her acceptance and beliefs with the LGBTQ community. Um, and it's tough because I, when I called her out on the internet, I didn't mean for it to be as explosive, as explosive as it was. And I think that was a moment for me of like, all right, this doesn't mess up. You know what I mean? And so she called and we talked about Well, the about first it. thing was not, was just about, you said she was mean to you. Yes. Yes. So that, that we called about, um, she called me, she was like, will you make a statement online? And I was like, I, I said, no, I said, but if you say something and you say whatever, I was like, I'll reply and I'll engage and I'll make it very clear that like, you're good. there's no fire, you know yeah. what I mean? And so we did that and everything was fine and whatever. And then a few months later, some stuff came out about her saying that LGBTQ relationships were not traditional marriage and she wants to make movies that are specifically about- She changed networks because of that. Yeah. and It wasn't so much that she didn't want to do movies about that. She didn't even want to work for a network that did that. Exactly. And so it was a little bit like, ooh, you got me to say this and then now you're doing that. You know what I mean? And so- with that, I, I think I posted something about that or maybe I made it and saved it in my drafts. No, I think I posted it. I don't know. I don't remember. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't either. Um, I either posted it or I was going we to post it. We could look it, it up. It if, we, if you posted it, where would it be? It'd either be on my TikTok or my Instagram. Um, so see if there's something on her TikTok that uh, mentions Candace. But it felt like a knife, right? Because you already like squashed beef and then yeah. it's like... Darn. And like, then it was like, I have beef with you again for something. Yeah. And it was like, but bigger. I just wanted. That I'm, wasn't a personal. Well, it, it is personal, right. but I'm just saying it it's bigger than personal that. to my family. You right. know what I mean? And, and I just was like, you know what? Nah, you know, I just had to like step back and we're, we're never going to agree. There's some really sad things that, uh, behind closed doors that I've just had to be like, okay, the world doesn't need to know these things. I don't need to publish these things. I don't need to talk about these things, but I need the world to know that I do not stand with her. And I don't agree with her. Um, Cause I well, gotta stand up for my people. I think we all have to stand up for all people. That I agree that's with that. The, that's the key. We have yeah. to stand up for all people yeah, and everybody right. is, love is love. Yep. And everybody needs respect. Yep. And if you're publicly showing disrespect. Yes. And or, I think she could be a really good example of religion doesn't mean homophobia. You know what I mean? And I think that's a, a very common misconception is that you can't have both religion and acceptance for LGBTQ community. Yeah, you can. And you can. You can, yeah. And I think she could be a fine example of that because she is very open about her religion and very public about it. Um, but she chooses not to be, and that's that's okay, you know? That's not her life path. But being friends with her isn't mine. 